Hey guys, it's Aaron, and you've probably been wondering why I haven't been posting videos lately. It's because of this. We've been taking our new Winnebago Solus, which we got a couple of weeks ago, on day trips. So, today I'm going to give you a tour of it. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the front seats. Here you've got an armrest, it's the basic controls of a car, cup holder, and these chairs both the passenger and the driver swivel at 360 degrees. Now let's go farther into the middle section of the van. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the middle. Here, we have a magnetic screen door. You can just walk right in and it'll open. And then we have just the seats, lots of storage. We have a table that you can hold up. And then there's actually some stuff under the seat mostly storage that you can just pull up on this little yellow hook and then you have plenty of storage here for whatever you need and then we have the fridge there's a latch can just push down on this. It does come with an ice cube thing. And then, now I'm going to show you the top. Okay, so this is the ladder. You can just unlatch it, latch it. Pretty easy self-explanatory of how to open it, I mean fold it, and then you can just crawl up it. Now let's actually get up into the bunk. I haven't slept here, but I have hung out in it a little, so it's pretty good. There's a vent there, and then you can just pull down on this to get it so that the whole thing comes down. And then we have, again, just things to put in your devices and all that. And then behind me, well, and from me, there's a little light, which activates with this light switch. And then we have two windows, one's behind the camera, so you can't see it. One's here. One's here. Both of the ones you just saw. And then there's this clear one. You, it is a little short, so you can't stand up in it, but it is a pop top, so pop tops are usually short. And you can just clasp this together. So let's get on to farther into the middle section. Okay, so now I'm going to show you a little bit more 
about this and then move on to the kitchen. So the table can basically move 360, but there are chairs in this. This is basically where I sit when we're driving. Pretty fun. There are window shades included. So that's about it for the table section. There's not much more except an armrest. Just like the one in the passengers. I mean driver's seat and then here we have the stove top which of course I'm not going to show you. Well I'm going to show you inside but I'm not going to show you the fire. I think it's pretty good. We haven't tried it out yet. And then we have the sink, basically hot cold filter. It's pretty basic. You don't really need to know anything to learn how this. And then here we have the bathroom. There's a light switch in the bathroom. This is pretty wide, so you're probably not going to want to open it or close it when somebody's in your way. Then you can just close this door. And then here you have your shower head, hot and cold. Here's a little compartment that you can lock and unlock. You have your toilet here, which you can basically, it's a cassette toilet, the same ones you see at the construction sites. There's a flush button here. Um, there is, there's a rack here, and that's about it for the bathroom. And then, here we have the back of the van. So here we have the bed, which is all I can show you right now. So it's kind of high. So it's kind of a struggle to get onto. And then it does have windows. And then it has storage, which you can just push this. We'll hook this down and then push this up. There's even a power outlet in there. And then again, here you have your power outlet. 12 volts, USB. And then, now I'm going to fold this up so that we, I can show you more under the bed. Okay, so now I'm going to show you more of the kitchen. Here is extra countertop space. And there might be something on there. I don't know. Again, we've only had this for a week or two. And then, her. again, we have more extra countertop space, which these um, little switches are pretty powerful, so I had my dad open them beforehand, so I could just put them open easier. And then here we have just a little extra counter space. It is very pretty, I like it. So, you can just fold this up. Very heavy. And then here we have our um, mesh again. 
And then here's just a little couch. There is a lot of storage right here, so you can keep a lot of things. There's also this storage that you can just open up. It's kind of heavy, but you can store quite a lot of things. Again. And then here we have this switch that tells you how much the water tank is full. And then we have more storage, but some of these have magnets so that you can just kind of push them up. It is a little high, and then you don't have to worry about it falling way down here. So that's a big, again, stove, on top of space. And then we have drawers. And that's about it. Bye.